Okay, so there's two cars on the road. There's car A here and car B. Car A has a mass of a thousand kilograms. Car B has a mass of 1500 kilograms. Car B is traveling at zero meters per second and car A is traveling at 12 meters per second. Now car A and car B crash. So car A and car B become one entity, car AB, which has a mass of, well, add those two together and you get 2,500 kilograms. And we want to work out the speed at which it will be travelling. So we'll put V meters per second. So what's V? Well, we can work out V by working out the P before. But what's P? P is the momentum of the vehicle. Now, how do we work out momentum? We use the equation P equals mv. So, we take the mass of car A and times that by the, the speed and then add that to the mass of car B times the speed of car B. But wait, the speed's zero, so we don't need to do that. We can just work out the momentum of car A, which is 12,000 kilograms meters per second. And then we work out P after. And this is 2,500 kilograms times V, which equals 2,500 V. But wait, doesn't P before equal P after? Yes, so 12,000 kilogram meters per second is equal to 2,500 V. So using that, we can do some simple rearranging and work out V. So V equals 12,000 over 2,500. So V equals 4.8 meters per second. Right up here, 4.8 meters per second after collision. Thank you for watching and if you have any questions just leave them in the comments below.